but what could cause the entire band to bail? Oh, I love that. Like I said, like, when you have less animation, less is more, and like the things you do are stronger and very sexy. Where? They're already gone. Pretty impressive how fast they can move, even with their hands full. But what could have made them run like that? Anon! How could Nasser make them run? Oh, I turn around to see Nasser and Naomi approaching, food in hand. I knew I'd find you here with the others, Anon! Shame they ran off! Why would they do that? Her shrill, goody goody sugary voice is piercing through the chat of the lunchroom. I won't reply if that means hearing more of her voice. Wasn't that not a sister? How wonderful that you're making friends, Anon. Now tell me everything. What were you and Fang talking about? I want to know all about it. Oh god, I just can't catch a break. I just want to go home. But there's still half the day to go. Hey, Anon. Uh, you uh, seem kind of low energy, alright? Anon? The Anon you are trying to reach is currently having an extension existential nightmare. Night <laughs> meltdown. Please leave your message after the screen. Anon, just let it out. Oh, he's just thrilled to make new friends! Yeah, man, good on you. You're quite the extrovert. I'm mentally screaming, I swear, I just want to get out of here and never come back! Was that really my sibling you were hanging out with? Fang and a, f Fang and a friend, yes. Strange group, I know. I'll, s I'll say. Uh, uh, shit. Uh, they are not as bad. Would you get to know them? Colorful, colorful folk, I know. Literally, they're also colorful. Um, uh, no, I mean, they... Oh, he's talking singular. And he's plural. Hmm? Fang! Oh, 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 huh. Yeah, I'm sure seems so. Seems I'm going to have to be a lab partner for the rest of the year. Whoa. Naomi pauses for a second. Honestly, they're just going through a phase, man. Oh, no, right. Of course that's Nasser, because I just know Naomi doesn't say man. Honestly, they're just going through a, a phase, man. There should be, shouldn't there be a comma there? That phrase, that phase include rants about non-binarism? It's like albinism, right? <sighs> Fang at you with that, too? What a great opportunity for real friendship, Anon. I'm so happy for you. Just ignoring the, 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 the shared bro moment of, like, getting yelled at by bitches. <laughs> just ignoring all that. Why is she called a slut, though? She seems like the kind of person who's just too busy bouncing to do anything that involves sitting still anywhere. Like, she doesn't go to bed. She just runs lap around the house. Uh, does any... If there's anything Fang needs in these trying times, it's a new friend to talk to. Uh, I don't know about that, but you know how they is, all right? I would love it if you tried. Nasser would appreciate it. Would he? Oh, whoa, calm down, Bo. That's not how it works. I don't think. It's all right, cause I'm saved by the. It's all right, cause I'm saved by the. It's all right, cause I'm saved by the bell. As ever. Finally. Jesus Christ. Poor... Sorry. Raptor Jesus. Poor Anon has just been trying to escape conversations for an hour of lunch. What a man. What a hero. What a trooper. After freaking out over his porn. I imagine it's porn, otherwise he wouldn't be so iffy about it. Unless it's embarrassing to like anime. I don't know. It might be. Poor anime studios all over. I feel like there should be like a bit of his hair here on the other side. But that might also make the, this a bit too corner, too bit too busy. I like what they did with him, though. Give him that little <coughs> in the hair. The bell's so loud in our ears. A rush of relief and dopamine overcoming. Finally, I'm free. I'm free. Ah, Anon and I are synchronizing. <laughs> I don't want that. I want the better Anon to synchronize with me. The other Anon can fuck right off. Uh, we'll talk later, Anon. I'll keep, have to keep my eye on there, though. Don't worry, Nasser. I know Anon is a good character. And if not now, he'll be there later. What is she talking about? You know what? It doesn't matter. None of this matters. Only useful thing I learned all day. Uh, I guess I'll have to go now. See you around. Such a shame. Bye. Be a little nicer, Anon. Ask if you need anything. I'll help you out. That would have been great for Nasser, actually. Oh, gee, that went this way. <laughs> Nice, now you'll never get them off of your back. Congratulations! Hey, hey, take it easy, man. If I knew you'd be in a jock, I'd like, hey, take it easy, man. A bit more energy. Come, Nasser, we have a busy day today. Oh, sure. See ya. I think it's cute that they are bundled up. 
They make a cute couple, even if he's very tired. <laughs> One week late. Oh, wow, we're two weeks in, right? Well, half of six months done. That's math. Bane of stupid people and lazy intellectuals alike. Yeah, man. High five. And teachers, too, judging by the lack of a certain Kuma teacher. Ooh! I only learned what a Kuma was, like, nine months ago. <laughs> but somebody used that ironically. Wait, wasn't your... Oh, oh, that's that's why. In case you don't know, uh, it means exactly what you think it does. It's 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 uh, someone who has um. Let's not go into that. Substance work today, which means busy work. Group problems, busy work specifically. Of course, I can't escape this any more than I could have escaped the lab partner assignment. At least I have the opportunity to keep to myself. Hasn't there already been like another science lab? I don't bother attempting the assignment instead of pretending my phone is a calculator, and spending the first half shit posting about video games I haven't even played online. The second half interrupted by something pointy to the back of the dome. I can feel something between my chair and back. I fish around to find a crumpled paper airplane. Complete. A completed set of problems. This is reads and it's done. And the extra problems I didn't even bu <sighs> I turn around to see that technically burnout waving over me. He's sitting next to Trish, as always. She's giving me the evil eye. At least I think it's the evil eye. Whatever the expression is, it clashes with a smile. Might as well see what they want. As I weave through the maze of desks squished together. Man, I remember those days. In fact, I remember those chairs. I know the, what those chairs are. And I know leaning back on those chairs. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Together with partners more interested in their phones than their worksheet, I catch a hint of whatever Reed and Trish are talking about. Honestly, honesty is the best policy, eh? It's a hint! Bad juju to keep something bottled up. It's a hint! For you, the player. Because Reed is God. And I want to kiss him. Listen, all I'm saying is that this series is going to be in irrevocably contaminated by the fact that I will viciously describe putting my hands on his chest and all the stuff that happens afterwards. I'm going to play him like a bongo. <laughs> Actually, you probably didn't have the pecs for that. Can you play a muzzle? Because that's a lot of bony structure, right? I could take his drumstick and go... Doo -doo 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 it's like, don't move, Reed. You're interrupting band practice. Listen, at the way I'm going right now, there will be a part where I will... Softcore. We're keeping it softcore. I am not registering another series as 18+. Plus. That happened like once or twice with Night in the Woods, mostly because of context. I could do it. Actually, I should just do it. Go there. But it's awkward, isn't it? It's a little awkward. Reed, Reed grabs a hold of another chair and sets it on Trish's other side, nodding in my direction before taking a big pull of whatever he's got in that thermos on his desk. The widening of his pupils suggests there's more than raw box code. For Listen, and I love how they keep referencing these goofy-ass brand names. They're great. I love them. Like, there's so much tiny bits of world building going on here. It's great. Hey, Anon! You guys need something? Nah, just wanted to chat a bit, since we got the time. There's something in her tone of voice. It's like she's getting ready to gore me with those nubs. She goes, listen, man, it's not the size that matters. It's how you use it. Serious Sam taught me that. It's not the size that matters. It's how many bullets you have for your cannon. I'm sorry, cannonballs you have for your cannon. You got enough? You can take care of that warlock. Sure. I'ma let you two go do whatever. Gonna get a refill. I gotta go hit the horny player on the head, dude. He's being way too horny, and since I'm God, I can poke outside the video game, so uh, don't mind me. I'm totally gonna bop him on the head. And on, do not think that something gay is happening. If you hear kissing sounds, that's someone else. Why is he like this? Uh, you know how it goes when you meet God. I mean, like, I meet him. <laughs> he shakes his thermals and has to... What? Is he gonna brew up a fresh batch? What? What's in that, anyway? Don't... Don't ask. Fair enough. Oh, I forgot. Wait. Fuck it. So, Anon, you and Fang. You and Fang what? They've been talking about you. 
Let's see. The tiny triceratops rolled around dramatically. Fang! Fang's been talking about you! Good things, I'm sure. Fang's been talking about me? That's dumb! Oh, yeah, the phones. All we've been doing is more lab work and science. Last Thursday, I tried to remember how to make a railgun. To show I could, of course. Pfft, I can make one, too. She seemed unimpressed at the time, but... Uh, was it about making a railgun? Uh, yeah, it was. What exactly are you talking about with them? Just science stuff, like railguns! Do you know how much armor you can pierce with a standard-sized railgun? I do. I can even tell you how reactive armor... Shut up. A railgun is just something I happen to know. I happen to know, though. Picked up from an old game. Trish raises an eyebrow. Right. Why do you ask? You learned to make a deadly weapon from a video game? Her tone is flat. I'm like a chest. Well, that Jude! I wouldn't say... Don't interrupt. Why would you think it's a good idea to make a weapon in class? How did you not get in trouble? The Spears actually did talk to me, said something about the Great Equalizer. <sighs> this is why men are useless. What about non-binary people? They're not men. Yes, but... Ugh, never mind. She continues to mutter to herself, all of it incoherent. Is there a point? She's got five, baby! She rounds back at me, anger clearly painted on her face. Look, Anon, you may be into that stuff, but leave Fang out of it. They have better things to do than... than play with some man-child's litter. Lethal toys! Whoa, harsh. Reed slumps into the seat next to Trish, sipping his thermos of a... Just aqua, bro. Thermos of water. What the... What'd I miss? I, I'm just telling Anon that he shouldn't be telling Fang how to make a fucking gun in school. Why not? We've been over this! But we have? When? Less than five minutes ago! I thought we were talking about Anon. Yes! And specifically, we were talking about Anon's gun! Heads starts to turn. Reed grins at them all. Then how about these guns? He places his hands on the back of his head and flexes his biceps. <laughs> Trish just fucking loses it. <laughs> Trish's face is a blur of emotions. First confused, then fucking pissed, then aroused, and then back to fucking pissed. All in the space of an attosecond. Trish. Not those! The one he made with magnets! But like... How do magnets work? It's alright, cause I'm saved by the... Goddamn. All of a sudden, the students give the clock a blank stare, stand at attention, and file out the door. I know that vibe. I remember that vibe. It is strong in my soul. It doesn't stop just cause you're out of school, baby. It doesn't... It, it exists when you go to school, before. It is primordial to the human spirit. I d cannot read! Trish punches, punches Reed in the shoulder, gives me another evil stare, and saunters out of the room. What the fuck is your deal, Reed? You feel like you're in near constant damage control. Hey. Reed pats me on the shoulder. Bruh. He gives me a thumbs up and exits as well, leaving only the substitute teacher looking at me from her desk impatiently. Ugh. Guess it's time for her lunch period, too. I can't stop playing. What is this magical, mysterious Jogo? What is this mysterious Jogo? The term Jogo, mysterious Jogo, was invented for this video game. Naza ends up dra Why do I keep doing this? Naza ends up dragging me to sit with him and the magenta motor mouth again. Naomi hovers over Naza, who apparently ha who currently has Gucci under his eyes. What? So, so I uh, talked to the soccer team earlier. They're going to make the first game after all. Isn't that great, Anon? I also uh, got to the l, l Club to finally take down their Christmas decorations. What, like Legends and Lore, or is this something else? So the library's clean again. Nasser's head lands in this chicken salad, and he jerks wide awake. Oh, she's so an omnivore. Nasser! Oh, good lord, not the water! That's a good sprite. Love that art. Uh, 
Uh, sorry. Did you say something, Anon? Uh, Nasa, you look like you fell into another blender. Ano <laughs> and another one! And another one! And another one! What's going on, big guy? Ah, uh, don't worry about it. Just some, uh, family problems last night. Like what? Uh... You don't have to tell him if you don't want to, dear. Why don't you wipe that Alfredo sauce off your cute little face? Oh, there's something about this that feels like the art style is very different, but I think it's just me. Because, like, her normal style doesn't have a lot of the line art. Actually, the lines are a bit thicker. Don't know what's going on with that bump on the back of her hand, but hey! The pose works on the blush. She was so sucker when she could give third world country diabetes. And slow beef, too! It's my sister again. Why is it always a sister with him? It's a sibling, you fool. No. I was going to sleep last night and I heard something downstairs. When did this turn into an interrogation? It was about one or two in the morning. I checked what it was and, um... thing was just standing in front of the microwave, staring at the Dino Nuggets road pits. <laughs> dino Nuggies! Dino Nuggies! At one in the morning? At one in the morning. This is a personal issue, isn't it? Wouldn't you rather just be enjoying lunch with us? You know, I know something about where the story goes, and I gotta say, Naomi has this aura to her. A lot of things are really well set up. Like with Reed, and this, and everything. I just need advice from someone at this point, Naomi. But from Anon? But for me? Nasser continues. I asked her what she was doing, and she just uh, said, fuck off, and so I think maybe Dad will help. He didn't. He just got into a shouting match, screaming about her lack of control, and Dad was pissed, and... Oh, poor baby. Naomi wraps her head, arms around Nasser's head, cradling the tired terror saw within her bosom. And then he fucking died. There's a rumbling snore, and it's clear that Nasa has checked out. I just love how Anon fills space on the screen, but I forget he's there 90% of the time! <laughs> it's great! Right. Naomi looks distraught. He's always like this. It's been getting worse recently. You are like the one person who would benefit the most from Fang fucking off or stopping. Going unconscious? Trying to help. He's wearing himself ragged. I mean, I guess if he's like. You know, he helps a lot because he's an athlete and all that stuff, and he seems to take like the school seriously. I guess that Fang would be like, if I can't help my sister, can I help the school? You know, that Fang. Uh, we should help Nasser. What by talking to Fang? By taking him to the nurse's office. Oh fuck! No, he looks at me with the biggest, wettest doe's eyes possible. All right, all right. He doesn't look that heavy anyway. Only 160 pounds. How do you? Never mind. They probably knew when she hugged him. Naomi puts herself on the left arm, motioning me to take the other one. I sling his arm around my back and... Oh, good lord, he's heavy! All right, the nurse's office is down the main hall on the left side, near the front desk. I'm clenching my face too much to be able to speak. I can only get a slight nod out. After dropping Nasser at the nurse's office and leaving Naomi, before Naomi could argue with her about staying, the lunch bell rings. <sighs> could the music at the ass end of campus off the sprint of the halls? Fuck today. I avoided gym class for a reason. Halfway to music class, I slam into someone and tumble to the floor. Uh. <gasps> Stella! You're fat in the in, in Goodbye Volcano Hire. At least you're, you appear fuller than this. You! <gasps> ah, oh, sorry, sorry. I get up from the floor and look at the stego who bumped into me. The plate's on her back twitch as she looks me up and down. Judgment. A chill rolls over me. Karma? No, 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 no. Maybe second chance. She draws closer, a contemplative expression on her face. I see now. See what? Your important choices to come. I do? Wait, back up. What the fuck are you talking about? This. She reaches towards my chest, plucking something off of it. She holds it up for me to see. It's an oversized playing card. Still lost. It's you! Your card! You're the, on the precipice of a great ordeal. Many difficult points of divergence and contention are coming your way. Reflect on them. I think about asking the, the green weirdo to make sense, but the bell is about to ring. Yeah, thanks, sure. 
Sorry, got a dash. I have to do more. I, I can't. 